opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. c4 builds a strong center by controlling the important d5 square and creates a square for the knight to come to c3 without blocking the c-pawn. The king's Indian defense prepares to develop the bishop to g7, allowing white to build up a strong center which black will later try to undermine. And c3 prepares the e2-e4 pawn push and helps control the d5 square. The Grunfeld defense uses this pawn push to gain space in the center and attack the c4 pawn. And f3 supports the d4 pawn and puts pressure on the e5 square. Bg7 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. Bf4 develops the bishop to an active square where it controls the center. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Rc1 develops the rook and delays moving the e2 pawn, if black captures on c4, then e4 is a stronger move than playing e3 on move 6. This misses an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. It is good. This captures a vulnerable pawn. This threatens to win a pawn. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is the last book move. There was only one good move there. This misses an opportunity to kick a bishop. This permits the opponent to pin a pawn. It is a mistake. Takes back. It is good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is good. Recaptures. This threatens to prevent castling. It is best. This places a rook on the seventh rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is excellent. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing rook. It is good. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is best. This threatens to win a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This is the only good move. This stops the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is a great move. This overlooks a better way to defend a pawn that was under attack. It is a mistake. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a miss. Very precise. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. This is the only move that works. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. This ignores a better way to add a defender to a vulnerable pawn. It is an inaccuracy. There was only one good move in that position. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is a mistake. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a knight. It is a great move. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is best. This lets the opponent capture a pawn to win material. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. It is a mistake. Capturing that pawn wins material. It is best. This fights against the opposing rook for the open file. It is best. White had an advantage, but now the game is close to equal. It is a mistake. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Takes back. This threatens to kick a queen. It is best. This threatens to double the pawns in front of the king. There was only one good move there. This misses a better way to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to double the pawns in front of the king. It is a great move. 
The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks a better way to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This creates a threat to win a pawn. It is excellent. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This wins material. It is excellent. This move puts the queen on a safer square. It is good. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is excellent. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only move that works. This threatens to play checkmate. It is brilliant. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. This stops the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is best. This forks multiple pieces. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is best.